Hello guys, Cube Bounty here. Um, just going to do a quick video today, as promised, on sort of all the stuff I'm going to be taking with me overseas. Well, I'm going to do several videos, I should say. First one is going to be on my carry-on equipment. So, 5.11 Rush 12. I'm just going to try and be as quick and concise with this video as possible. 5.11 Rush 12. Um, good size bag, just sort of good size to carry around in your arms when you've got your big bag on your back. Um, the front packet, uh, front pocket, I should say, not packet, has uh, all the standard medical gear. You can refer to my um, video on that if you want. Um, just a note, if you're going to be carrying any pills, especially like you know painkillers or whatever, um, prescription medication, make sure if it's prescription medication, it's in its um, in its regular bag uh, with the prescription visible. If it's something like Panadol or whatever, try and get a new packet. Um, keep it all in the little blister packs. Saves a lot of trouble when you're trying to get through customs. Uh, they will be a lot kinder to you. Um, remember to take out everything sharp from there. I've had to take out the metal tweezers and my um, EMT shears. Um, that's another big thing that you might get held up for. Um, spare clothes. Always bring a spare set of clothes. Um, I've got a shimmer, some wool socks, um, spare pair of pants in case it's cold. I've uh, got spare ankle socks, spare underwear, spare t-shirt. Um, I'll be carrying a, uh, carrying a jacket on with me under my arm because um, that then won't count as carry-on luggage and I can I have this paracord there to lash it on the side through the molly if I need to later. Electronics. Um, I have the camera which I'm holding right now because my phone's being a prick and I want to do videos. Um, that is an iPhone charger and a NZ to US adapter. I have some diffusers for my Phoenix LD10. LD10 is a great torch. Done a video on that. Headlamp, Phoenix headlamp, great thing with some spare batteries on the side. Um, my tripod for my camera and the case. Um, the case has an extra 8 gig um, little SD card inside of it, taped in there in a little packet. Uh, pens, a little fine black pen and a fine blue pen. Um, I like fine pens, they just seem to be neater. Phone, that'll be in my pocket, but I'll just put it there because it's being a pain in the ass and not doing videos. Travel wipes, these are useful if you get stuck in an airport and you want to wipe yourself down and feel fresh, even if for a little while, um, if you're all sweaty and gross, especially because I'm going in the summer, it's probably going to be hot. Two disposable ponchos in case I need to run to a bus somewhere or whatever and it's pissing down outside, um, they'll be useful and they don't take out much space or room. I have two of them, either in case I need to use two. I just want to throw the other one out when it's wet instead of packing it back up, or if I'm with somebody. Um, travel uh, laundry wash, uh, TSA approved, very important, um, right size too, because all the underwear I'm taking with me is this merino wool, which is great. It's cool in the hot and um, warm when it's cold, uh, nice and breathable, doesn't get smelly easily, which depends on how often I'm going to have to be recycling pairs of underwear, depending on how frequently I'm able to do washing. But um, that's the thing, is I want uh, this laundry wash because they just told me to put all my shit in the big laundry bag and they'll wash it for me and if some mongo that he throws all my nice expensive merino wool things in the hot wash and they come out shrunk I will not be very happy so I think I'm just going to wash my underwear and socks myself um, find a sink somewhere or a wash basin whatever um, small roll on deodorant you won't get on I don't think with an aerosol um, small is also a key word because of the whole TSA fluids thing Small hand sanitizer. Used this the other day when I was um, when the bathrooms at the airport were out of um, soap, so that was good because I wanted to eat, which requires my hands. Um, Falk Niven DC or Fel Niven, or however you pronounce it, DC4 sharpening stone. Um, just because that one, I'm going to have it with me at the other end. A um, couple of books. Uh, Sons of War, 1984 by George Orwell, and a moleskin notebook. Found this cool note uh, journal y thing at the Auckland airport the other day when I was waiting around for my flight back to Christchurch. Um, has a heaps of cool little travel quotes and it looks nice so I think I'm going to make a journal of my trip um, passport, you want your passport that's my British one, I am a British citizen as well as a New Zealand citizen so dual citizenship, beautiful thing um, spare iPhone battery uh, electrical tape chapstick uh, some striking away matches uh, the head thing cover for toothbrush because I'll have a toothbrush it's just out at the moment drawing some cheap throwaway earplugs in case there's some stupid annoying noises um, in my pocket of my shorts, and I'll be wearing these when I go as well. These are the True Spec little shorts. Um, I think they're still 24/7. Uh, I have a pair of Skull Candy um, ear smoking buds earphones because um, I'm probably going to be using my phone for quite a lot of music, um, as well as I've still got a notepad in my pocket and a pen, and a little bit more paracord, and then wallets. I always carry two wallets as well. Um, I don't like those passport wallets. Just carry two wallets, have a throwaway one. That way, if you do get mugged, which hopefully won't happen, um, you throw them one wallet with some bullshit ID in it, like an old 
library card or whatever and like 40 bucks um, 40 bucks is probably enough not to get stabbed in anger and, and but it's still not enough for you to really be too worried about fighting over it so you can just happily throw a second wallet away um, and it won't be a problem for example um, cheap shitty second wallet um, which I haven't used for years and I'll swap hands um, real quickly and real wallet full of that way around US dollars so um, that's something to be careful of anyway that's basically it for carry well yes that is it for carry on so I'll do another video shortly cheers guys